there was money being handed out. There were contests. And uh, I just left really impressed by the, the, the social skills that they had, the leadership skills they had. If I was pitching your, your class, and we have one of your students here, I would say it's a combination of, you know, it's got the current events, it's got the stand up and prove yourself and vote, um, and it has this extra component. So it's meet the press, plus survivor, and the dating game. <laughs> so the dating game you have to understand. Paul was putting up $100 for the best answers and the class would vote. It'd go around this whole square and everyone would vote who had the best answer. And that person got $100. It's not going to continue into this class, so don't even start. <laughs> it's a much bigger class. And so this person gets $100. And relatively timid person. So, so Paul says, you want to ask anybody to dinner on the $100 in front of your peers? 20-year-old kid. And the girl says, yes. I do. He says, go ahead. And he goes, and sell it. She turns to a, a guy across the way and says, how would you like to go to dinner with me? I'm going to pick you up in my silver eclipse. I'm going to be wearing a black dress. And we would have a great conversation. It would be a great night. And he says, I'd love to. I was so moved by <laughs> the nerve of something I would never do. I would instantly matched the 100 for 200. Said, go anywhere you want. <laughs> But that is an impressive person in front of a class that asks somebody out. And it happened twice. So take Paul's class, make some money, and get a date <laughs> and learn something. So congratulations on your class. That was a hell of a lot of fun.